Quavo is the kind of person that will take you unawares, right? When you feel like everything has died down, this man is gonna rise up and come for you. You get what I'm saying? It's really going crazy because Quavo verifies how J Prince and Mob Ties cause take up death in Houston. And this is going crazy right now. But before we get into it, smash that like button, subscribe, turn on your notification bell so you get notified whenever I drop a new video. And remember, in few hours will be my birthday, so I'll be doing a lot of cash up giveaways so you can comment with your cash up in the comment section. So let's dive straight into this. Uh, we're gonna look at Quavo's recent song because you know the song has been going viral and a lot of people have been talking about it. But you know, some of the bloggers never looked into the lyrics of the song because when a rapper drops a song you actually want to look at the lyrics to really understand what the you know what the artist is talking about or what the rapper is talking about you know according to the things that is going on at the moment and remember the four tribal songs that quavo has dropped is always talking about the death of takeoff and stuff like that but on this song he just dropped yesterday is basically talking about you know everything that happened between takeoff him and j prince and mob ties in houston and a lot of goons has been sliding in you get what i'm saying so we're gonna jump straight into these lyrics and we're gonna read meaning into the lyrics you get what i'm saying so check this out quavo said they want to see my emotions i ain't smiling at all i bought a bulletproof home it could take down a world they don't want me talking like this gangster at all. So who do you think he's talking about right here? They want to see my emotions. You know, but I ain't smiling at all. You know, he is talking about J Prince Mokhtar. Could they say it on that interview, you know, with Million Dollar World of Game that, you know, Quavo will be coming out to say something and they're gonna, you know, they're gonna be looking at Quavo to verify everything. You know, they just said on Million Dollar World of Game, right? But Quavo is telling them that, you know, you guys want to see my emotions. You guys want to see how I react. And remember, this was the same issue that J Prince had with Offset. Because Offset reacted after that particular interview that, you know, J Prince and Mob Ties had with Million Dollar World of Game, right? Where they say that, you know, they heard what Offset said behind the scene that Offset was threatening his family and stuff like that and you know j prince decided to throw a shot at offset on that interview right and offset really got emotional and offset fired back you know sab offset fired back and he was emotional like you guys you niggas has been going on interviews and talking and the family is not even talking do you really care how we feel that's exactly what Quavo is saying here that they want to see my emotion i ain't smiling at all because you guys already seen offset emotion because offset was so emotional about it but Quavo mm, is not doing that so the second line is i bought a bulletproof home it could take down a world like you know he is ready to go after them for sure get what i'm saying so the bulletproof can signify him protecting himself so he already built everything he need to come after the people that is responsible that's supposed to answer a lot of questions concerning take off death and everything that happened in houston you get what i'm saying so the last line is they don't want me talking like this gangster at all so they don't want him talking you feel me like they really say that they went to Atlanta to you know make sure that Quavo never said nothing. They said after the death of Takeoff, you know they have to travel to Atlanta, meet up with Quavo and QC the record label and make sure everything was straight with them, right? And Quavo is telling you indirectly that they don't want me talking, right? They don't want me to say nothing, right here. And that's why they going on million dollar word of game to say that. Quavo will be validating everything they said if he ever talks, but they re don't really want him talking. That's why Quavo couldn't go to the HPD to, you know, write a statement to cooperate and get justice for takeoff, cause they don't want him talking. You guys can see that all over the song, you know, forget about the, 
uh, the treble he's paying to take off and stuff like that, which which was the major reason he dropped the song. But you guys gotta look at the lyrics and really understand what he's saying. They don't really want him talking. They want him to shut up. Do you think that Quavo feels good not going to the HPD, not going to the Fed, you know, to say something about the death of his nephew Takeoff? No, man. He really want to do that, but they don't want him talking. Like this gangster at all. They don't really want that. Because tell me, you know, if your family, right, anyone who is related to you got killed, and you know the people that are responsible you guys were invited to this big private event and you are superstars you're not just ordinary people in the street you get what i'm saying you are superstars you have a lot of fan base that means you have a lot of enemies right because whenever you blow up you're gonna have a lot of enemies those that like you and those that don't like you you're gonna have enemies that don't even like you for doing nothing at them like you never met these people before they are just your ups, right? They hate you for being successful. And that's what comes with success. You get what I'm saying? So you guys get invited to a private event. And these people tell you, listen up, just come to Houston, check in with us, and you know everything's gonna be cool. We're gonna make sure we'll give you a proper protection. You get what I'm saying? We're gonna make sure we'll give you a proper protection. And you believed these people, right? You linked up with them and checked in with them to their private event. And you go to the event, there was no proper securities, right? There is no proper protection because there is no police, there is no professional securities around the vicinity, you know, trying to protect people and make sure that everything was good. And your nephew ended up getting killed. What are you going to do, bro? You going to go out here to get justice for your nephew. You want them to answer so many questions, not just to go on interviews and say that, you know, this happened, condolences, and they are doing more interviews than the family that lost their loved one. Man, that's crazy. You know, a big rest in peace to take off, man. We've got to make sure we get justice for you out here. But remember, everything is the video still remains allegedly, but, you know, this is very heartbreaking. Because Quavo literally tell you that they don't want him talking, right? They don't want him talking because when he do the talking, it's going to be a problem because they know that, you know, they are about to go down. You get what I'm saying? And a lot of you all come under the comment section to say, oh, you don't know how J Prince moves, right? Things that happens in the underworld and stuff like that. But listen up, we have seen so many, you know, mob bosses and we have seen so many of them go down. If Osama Bin Laden can go down, if uh, Pablo Escobar can go down and stuff like that, my friend, everyone can go down. Trump was the former president of America. He went down, he got arrested, bro. Everyone can go down. Everything that is done in the dark can come to light. I want you all to understand that. You get what I'm saying? So the first thing joking out here, man, the first ain't joking out here. And, you know, we are sending our condolences to the family of Takeoff. No disrespect. You get what I'm saying? And to the people of ATL, you know, this is a very big loss in the industry. And we believe that, you know, justice is going to prevail, right? We're going to know the people that are behind the death of Takeoff. And we're going to make sure, and the feds and the authorities are going to make sure they bring those people to justice. But remember, everything in the video still remains allegedly. You get what I'm saying? I have a new song that just came out. The link is in the description. You can also watch my new music video. The link is also in the description. 